treasures everywhere We can use it anywhere Let's play and explore with its wonderful numbers Open your eyes and remember Learning mathematics is fun It is part of our daily lives Explore mathematics with teacher Marian Learning math is very fun There is joy for everyone Math the lead Hi my dear pupils! I'm so happy to see you today. I'm Teacher Marian, your grade 4 Math Lee buddy. Wear your beautiful smile and remember, the best way to learn mathematics is to do mathematics. Come on, Anna Antonio! Let's go to our Math Amazing classroom and see the progress of our room. Welcome back, Math Lee buddies. I am math thinker MJ, your companion in this mathly venture. It seems that you are trying to access a forbidden area to make this accessible. Get ready with your pen and paper because it's drill time. Now, let's look back at your previous lesson before you start a new and exciting one with teacher Marianne Anna and Tonyo. Are you ready? A bash and report! I will give you 10 seconds each question to add or subtract the following similar and dissimilar fractions. Remember to show your answer in lowest terms or simplest forms. Question number 1. 1 over 2 plus 1 over 3. A. 3 over 6. B. 4 over 6 C. 5 over 6 The correct answer is C. 5 over 6 Question number 2 3 over 5 minus 2 over 5 A. 1 over 4 B. 1 over 5 C. 5 over 5 the correct answer is letter B, 1 over 5. Excellent! Question number 3. 3 over 4 minus 1 over 3. A, 2 over 1. B, 5 over 12. C, 4 over 7. If you answered B, 5 over 12, you got it right. Question number 4. 20 over 28 plus 4 over 28. A. 6 over 7. B. 24 over 28. C. 16 over 28. The correct answer is A. 6 over 7. Math terrific! Did you get it all correctly? Congratulations! Access granted! You are ready to learn your new lesson with Teacher Marian. Keep up the good work, Mathali buddies! Math Galing! I am happy that together with Math Thinker MJ, you were able to add and subtract similar and dissimilar fractions using your big brain energy. Let us now go to our Math Amazing classroom. Teacher Marian, we're done fixing 10 areas in our Math Amazing Playroom. Yes, I agree. Look around our playroom. The tablet corner, game area, wallpaper, mat charts, bookshelves, cabinets, chalkboard, emergency kits, television, and windows are already fixed. Absolutely, Tanya. Thanks to Teacher Marian and our Math Delete Buddies. I'm glad to hear that, Anna and Tonyo. Another day, another challenge for us. But don't worry, we can fix it together with our Mathly Buddies. Since we are in our Math Amazing Playroom, you need to have a storage wherein you will put the things that are not needed in our mathematics class. Hmm, where do you think we can put it? 
Teacher Marian, Anna, and Magdali Buddies. Our classroom has mini lockers. I think we can use it to store our things. Oh no, Tonyo! It seems that the lockers are broken and in their worst condition. We need to fix this to put our things inside. Let's move closer. There are numbers. I can also see dots on these numbers. May I see it, Teacher Marian? Sure, Tonyo. Mm. Aside from the numbers with dots, there is also a direction here. Visualize the following decimal numbers using models like blocks, grid, number lines, and money. Letter A. Show the following decimals using grids. Number 1, 29 hundredths. Number 2, 15 hundredths. Letter B. Show the decimal using a number line. Number 3, 2 tenths. Letter C. Show the decimal using blocks. Number 4, 8 tenths. Letter D. Show 50 centavos in decimal form. Visualize decimal numbers using models like blocks, grid, number lines, and money. I am not familiar with that. Likewise, Anna. But I am excited to learn that lesson today. Of course, Anna and Tonyo. I know that you are all eager to learn our new lesson today. This calls for another Magdali Venture! Have you ever wondered what four tenths look like using a given model of blocks? How about twelve hundredths look like using a grid? What about three tenths in a number line? And twenty-five hundredths in a money form? The numbers which have a dot after the ones digit are called decimal numbers. These digits after the ones denoted tenths, hundredths, and so on. Let us go back to our first question a while ago. Have you ever wondered what four tenths look like using a given model of blocks? Look at the blocks model to visualize four tenths. Observe that there are 10 blocks representing the whole. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. There are 4 blocks crossed out. 4 blocks out of 10. This can be written as 4 tenths in decimal form and 4 over 10 in fraction form. This time, look at the grid. Observe that there are 100 squares. This means the whole is equally divided into 100 squares. There are 12 squares shaded out of 100 squares. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. The 100 squares represent the whole. 12 out of 100 cubes are shaded. 12 over 100 is in fraction form, and it can be written as 12 hundredths in decimal form. You will notice that 12 hundredths has two decimal places. Decimal number can also be visualized through number line. The region from 0 to 1 represents a whole. The region has 10 intervals. And the length of each interval is one tenth. Three tenths is represented by this interval. This can be written in decimal form as three tenths and three over ten in fraction form. Lastly, look at twenty-five centavo coin. This can be written as twenty-five hundredths in decimal form. Now. Your turn! I will give you 15 seconds to visualize each of the following decimal numbers using blocks, grids, 
number lines, and money to show the relationship to fractions. Ready, Math Dali Buddies? Abash and Show the following decimals using grids. Number 1, 24 hundredths. If your answer is letter C, you got it right! Number 2, 7 tenths. Letter C, you are correct! This time, show the following decimals using blocks. Number 3, 8 tenths. If your answer is letter A, math amazing! Number 4, 5 tenths. Letter C, excellent! You are doing great, Math Belly Buddy! Now, Show the following decimals using number lines. Number 5, 1 tenths. Letter A, you are correct. Number six, six tenths. If your answer is letter B, very good. Lastly, show the following decimals using money. Number 7, 75 hundredths. Letter C, Matherific! And number 8, 85 hundredths. Letter A, Math Amazing! Congratulations, Math Lily Buddy! Math Terrific! Now that you have learned how to visualize decimals, it's time for our Math Lily Activity! Math Lily, Math Lily, Math Lily Activity Time! Be given 15 seconds to answer each number to finally fix the lockers. Remember, basta kasama si Teacher Marian ngayong second quarter? Kaya yan! Ready, Math Dali Buddies? Abash every book! Show the following decimals using grids. Number 1, 9 tenths.
if your answer is letter C, math amazing! Number 2, 15 hundredths. Letter A, great job! Show the decimal using number line. Number 3, 2 tenths. If your answer is letter B, math terrific! Show the decimal using blocks. Number 4, 8 tenths. Letter A, you got it right! Show 50 tenths in money form. Is your answer letter B? Great job! Blended Answers Math Terrific Math Amazing You did a magnificent work We can now use these lockers to store our things that we don't need in our mathematics class Congratulations Anna, Tonyo, and our Mathnally buddies Yay! Wow! High five! We've done it! To sum up you have learned how to visualize decimals using blocks, grids, number lines, and even money to show relationship to fractions. The numbers which have a dot after the ones digit are called decimal numbers. These digits after the ones denoted tens, hundreds, and so on. Do you want to be our mathly buddy of the day? Come on! Take a picture of yourself with the help of your parents or guardian while watching our math episodes in DepEd TV. Post it on your parents or guardian's Facebook account and use the hashtag hashtag MathDallyBuddy4 or simply message our Facebook page MathDallyBuddy with your name and school. Keep this in mind, the best way to learn mathematics is to do mathematics. Remember, basta kasama si Teacher Marian at si Math Thinker MJ ngayong second quarter, kaya yan! That's it for today, Mathdali Buddies. See you on our next math exciting and math amazing activities.